Hello there everybody, Embrix here, and by the way, uh, I just wanted to real, uh, real quickly mention uh, my little, um, if you saw the Hogwarts Express review, which go check that out, um, I had like a, my sig fig and it said subscribe and stuff like that, um, just three seconds at the beginning and end, I'm trying to figure out a better way to do that, but until then, you know, that's not gonna be here, but, uh, we are taking a look at a mock from my mock city, this is my beach slash water, it's done on a base plate and half a base plate but let's take a look at the base plate with the beach first so um let's see what we got here it's done on a 32 by 32 uh, kind of tan or peach base plate which um now lego doesn't make these so we got beach chairs all along the back right there simple builds and umbrellas two different styles from the friends line just a figure um relaxing a dog and here we have floaters or flotation devices and a number, 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 number of um, life vests, the old style and the new style from the new Outdoor Adventures. Just got a figure here. Uh, I don't know. I'll um, by the way, figures aren't complete. I'm still like adding in figures. Um, and you know, I'll like, once I add in all figures, I'll do a whole figure update or when I add in a good number. Um, that's a volleyball net right there, uh, by the way, in case you're wondering. And it looks okay, kind of like the wind is shaping it, I guess. Here um, is the lifeguard stand. We have a ladder going up, a place for him to sit. Speakers that could hold binoculars uh, or up there, so four clips, yeah. And it, it, it looks pretty good in my opinion. We got a nice stand castle right here. That looks really nice to me. Shovel and flag. Hey, it's a cameo. It's Superman. Yeah, the um, because look, it really looks like he could wear this underwater. The life vest is covering the Superman logo, so it really just fits in well. And we have some nice parts part usage with a shell right there. Don't look at that yet. That's a surprise. But another kind of lifeguard from the same team because they're wearing the same thing is eating a popsicle. And has binoculars. We have someone fishing right here. And a guy who's about to go deep sea diving. And that looks pretty cool right there. Uh, we got two sort of food stands or one food stand for ice cream. And one place uh, that rents out scuba diving gear. Um, so you can see all the flippers that they'll take down, uh, the sort of awning. There's a scuba diving helmet, a life vest, and an air tank. In the front side of that, done in a dark blue, a darkish color scheme. And in the back, we have places uh, for figures and to hold money, just one stud exposed. Here's the um, ice cream place. We have a pirate who, wow, uh, sorry about that. Uh, wow, she didn't even replace her hand, but she did replace her peg leg probably to walk and oh my god it just fell apart okay so i fixed that and as i was saying she ordered an ice cream still has to pay we have a hundred dollar bill right there these are money holders uh little ice cream machines uh that's probably chocolate and that is vanilla and then cones and i represented more cones by just putting studs underneath to show that they're sort of stacked um within or inside each other as well so um the water technique though i really like this and I'm happy I came up with it, so let's, yeah, we can keep those on. So, you know how the shore, it always goes, the tide, it goes up and back? So this is frozen in time again, and I made it go up with all these see-through um, one-by-twos or transparent, and then I used little one-by-one -one white studs to show the bubbles or the sea foam, and I just think that that's a great effect. I'm so happy with um, how it turned out. I make mocks to get better at mocks. So uh, if I ever do a make a better beach, it will definitely use um, that technique. But the water, hey, that's a big part of the beach. You got that one fishing right there and you can see how that lines up. But right here, let's move this a bit out of the way so that this can take center stage. Um, you can see um, we have two guys right here with matching tattoos. And their little son, see how he's shorter, so I just used his head. We got fishes all around the place. Um, we have this little rock jutting out with a uh, turtle. And then we have um, there, that's from the Ninjago line. Like, someone uses it on their head, but I made it into a sort of sea creature. Fish coming right at him. We have some water being kicked up by the swimmer right here. All these figs are custom, by the way. We have two heads in the water, way deep. We have, I made this kind of jet ski mock right here. Um, speed dial, someone can stand here and someone can sit here. So yeah, driver is always more comfortable and that's where like the water would gush out or whatever. And you can see uh, the waves that I made with uh, cheese slopes. 
I have lighter colors on the shallow side and then it comes into this dark color on the deep side so that's probably where the short minifigures wouldn't be able to stand and the ones with mid legs would just have their head but this is like ultra deep so these two have a long legs right there but um yeah that is it for this video i hope you liked it please subscribe for more of my lego related stuff leave a comment down below and i will talk to you again soon bye